the new storm moving in this morning after that deadly holiday weather. Eight states on alert following dangerous flash floods and ice across the middle of the country. Oklahoma's governor has declared a state of emergency, and ABC's Philip Mena is there in the hard-hit city of Edmond. Good morning, Philip. Hi, George. Good morning. The Oklahoma City area is finally thawing out this morning, but take a look at the damage that the ice did to this massive tree. The weight completely splitting this tree open. And this morning, residents across this entire region are left picking up the pieces. Weather mayhem hitting millions. Oh, it's coming down. No way you should have survived that. I know. In Utah, this 32-year-old woman, lucky to be alive this morning, trapped in freezing water after falling through thin ice while trying to reach one of her dogs. Walking out onto the ice, you could hear it cracking beneath my feet. The incredible rescue caught on an officer's body camera. We got the dog. Have your dog. dog. <laughs> I can't stand. Thank Grab you her. so okay. much. In Arkansas, floodwaters running rampant. Uh, female stuck in a vehicle with water pouring in. The driver of this white sedan hydroplaning into a creek. Three passers-by helping her escape in the nick of time. In all, at least 14 deaths resulting from these intense storms hitting the plains and Midwest. Across Oklahoma, all 77 counties in a state of emergency. A combination of icy conditions and toppling trees knocking out power for at least 80,000. It's been quite devastating. Dozens of power poles shattered into pieces. These power lines caught on camera catching fire. Oh, wow. That thing just blew. Residents here in Oklahoma are getting some help with this massive cleanup effort. The governor stepping in and declaring a state of emergency. George.